Hello everyone. Uh, welcome to part 26 of Ecom series in Laravel 5.6. Uh, so we will continue our last issue that we are facing in our last video. Uh, actually, uh, what thing we are facing? Uh, we are facing like uh, actually we are not getting the complete products of our category. Like uh, if we are going to assess T-shirts. And here, what we want to do, uh, we want to uh, we want to have casual T-shirts as well as formal T-shirts. So means we want to have both these subcategories uh, uh, yeah, in our main category T-shirt. So the uh, casual T-shirt is having uh, these two, and formal T-shirt is having these two. So these four T-shirts are there yeah, as a total in T-shirts category, and that uh, four T-shirts uh, we want to show, but only two are showing right now. So we want to display all four. So in part 26, we are going to resolve this issue uh, that we are facing in part 25. In part 26, we will uh, show uh, all products uh, in our main category uh, uh, like uh, all products in our paid category that are uh, that are uh, that are stored uh, in uh, their subcategories in the subcategories of the main category of the main category uh, for example like uh, uh, t-shirt uh, is the main category is the main category and uh, casual t-shirt uh, is the subcategory t-shirt is the subcategory having two products and formal t-shirt subcategory uh, subcategory having two products means both are having two, two products so uh, we want to display uh, uh, casual t-shirts and formal t-shirts means two plus two equal to four products uh, in t-shirt category that will contain uh, the uh, two two products uh, for uh, uh, both of these categories so in total we want to show these four uh, products in our t-shirt category so uh, we will uh, we are doing last time this thing and we will simply update our code is very simple to update uh, we are very close uh, just uh, just minor uh, uh, mistake we have made we actually are creating a string here but we will use array here uh, we will not do like this we will simply uh, use array means categories ids array we will uh, add values in our array simple very simple and i am uh, making this stupid mistake so see this array uh, will have all the values from one by one like first time uh, whatever is the subcategory id uh, it will store that id and in next time also it will store that id in for it so if you will check this array you will get uh, uh, both the subcategories ID in this array. Let's see. See now. So yes, we will get C. Now we will get three as well as six values. See, uh, and we are having three ID, three category ID and six category id uh, is the uh, ids of the subcategories see here and three is casual t-shirt and six is forum t-shirt so <coughs> both these subcategories we are getting under t-shirt and now we will use this uh, here uh, get edit here we don't require now array array is already this is array so we will simply use like this and now we will display 
leave products that all products are coming or not and see now all products are coming one two three four total of four products are there see two of the products is having category id3 and two of the products is having category id6 so now uh, now all the four products are coming with this and now we will display uh, in t-shirt now see yeah now see all the four products are coming correctly see now the first time uh, we have done this thing when we will go to our t-shirt category all the four products will come both uh, casual t-shirt and former t-shirt products will come and if we will go to any particular category then only the products of that particular category casual t-shirts will come like two products are come okay now we will go formal t-shirt then again two products are come that belongs to this formal t-shirt okay now see now everything is clear to you see now t-shirt now t-shirt will display all four products in case of uh, shoes it will display all these shoes so we have only four shoes okay and casual shoes there is no shoes at all so it will not display any shoes and four shoes it is having one shoe and in common it is only one shoe so that shoes uh, will be displayed when we open shoes category okay now i hope everything is now clear uh, so uh, our main categories uh, are uh, displaying uh, all products of their subcategories correctly now okay so uh, hope uh, everything is clear to you now and uh, you enjoyed watching this video in last video uh, we made this mistake but now we have resolved now so from next video uh, we will continue uh, working on other things uh, we will display error message if uh, if our uh, category is not correct if you will display some kind of like this kind of stuff uh, or by mistake if we will do spelling mistake like uh, something like this then we will display we will display 404 error message we will do that thing also and we'll continue with detail page so in next video we will display uh, uh, error page if our category url is incorrect okay and then we'll continue and then we'll start actually start working on detail page right okay so stay tuned soon for next video uh, and thanks for watching Hope everything is now clear and uh, you enjoyed. Uh, okay, uh, have a nice time. Thank you. Goodbye.